Good evening. My name is Dr. Aizel Dean Ali, and I'm an associate professor of sports management at the Department of Health, Physical Education and Recreation, College of Education, Florida A&M University. And I'm so proud to introduce this research paper about the digital currency trade and use the impact of the globalization of sports business. So the, the world is so small right now. And the digital, the digital coins is is like going crazy in the future, and um, it does affect so far the globalization of the sports business, the trade, the sell, um, all the market related, and dealing with sports management, and dealing with sports business and r regular dollar. And it's the same thing, but now it's moving more into the digital uh, coins. One of those really big uh, deal in digital coin is Bitcoin. And um, um, in this research paper, uh, or this research, um, we have some term or terminology, keyword, mainly sports marketing, sports finance, networking, globalization, digital coins, Bitcoins. Crypto, cryptocurrency so it's it's a interact it's really interacting a lot between all those aspects together and how much this really affecting on the sports so Bitcoin is one of those really uh, famous digital uh, digital coins or the cryptocurrency or digital uh, currency so the Bitcoin is actually um, today, recently, like today, the price of this Bitcoin is it's nine thousand nine hundred sixty-two point two three today, just today in the market, and today is uh, January. Today is um, um, June six or seven. Um, it's little bit almost close to midnight, but um, here in Florida, and the price of the Bitcoin currently is nine thousand nine hundred sixty-two point two three cent, and it's really um, increasing. But it's still, those days are getting a little, little bit down in the level of the value of, for the Bitcoin in the market. But I want to take you back a little bit to 2014. 2014, there was really a huge increase in the Bitcoin pr prices. It was it was almost uh, 16 million, 16,934 uh, uh, dollar and 63 cent, and the market was steady for two three years, and then suddenly go all the way up between 2013 and 2014. And I, I want to give you some um, history background and some prediction about Bitcoin. So if we are just going to predict or estimate Bitcoins by 2030, and if it's hit the 1 million price target, so the $100 investment will return or gain about $6,000. So... $100 investment um, you can gain in the market that's almost six six thousand dollars so that's a that's a huge investment and if we relate that to sports with the revenue that coming from sports I believe that that's also gonna be a big deal so in one of the story the current story uh, one of our alum donate $100,000 but in Bitcoin so it's really going across nation people donate people doing fundraising using digital coins and bitcoin is one of those really huge famous currents so our current study digital we are talking about introducing digital currency especially bitcoin as it's the first crypto coins actually created and and it was equal to gold in 1990. Uh, but there was a drop a little bit in 2009 and 8, 9, we had a, a recession in the economy and 
that's why there was a little bit drop in the, in the level or the price of the Bitcoin. But it came back really very aggressive uh, by the 2014. And as I mentioned previously, it was almost $14,000. Um, so this current study actually explains the significance of the stock market to the sports. So the legal side, the current use of those digital uh, coins and the future two aspects, especially when we're talking about sports business and globally too. And I did use, um, and this is so, this is mainly like a descriptive study. I did collect all my data through um, articles, um, some analytics predictions, um, magazine, newspaper across the this, this sta state and also globally. Um, but what actually I found, it's really rapidly growing and the trade market is actually affecting the sports as one of those business or industry so sports industry is one of those really famous industry across the world too and it so i felt like this is very important to like heads up we, we can really start to use more digital coins into sports and improve sports and increase the revenue too so the global sports market actually we're talking about 141 billion dollar um, 141 billion dollar in the sports industry so imagine using this uh, and that was uh, that was 2009 and 2023 it's it's i would say um 20 percent more the value is 20 percent more the global so the sport as a business is offered massive potential for revenue generation um, so we can generate a lot of money globally across the sports marketing. Bitcoin and some other digital coin like Ethereum, some other digital coins are, are really very famous these days and it's a, it's a great business to improve sport. And I believe through the prediction reading across literature, I found Bitcoin should be used to raise uh, the, the profit, the profit ratio uh, to the income in sports. And so when let's say sell tickets and we keep the revenue and invest it in a digital format or digital coins, it might be uh, with the market going up and down, it's gonna be steady a little bit, but it might be three or four times the revenue that we are really collecting. Sports marketing is one of um, good ways to bring more revenue to the athletics and so it might be treble um, revenue and there's some risk but it's still investment but most of the study the prediction it's on the favor of um, of the digital coin so if we combine sports marketing and digital coin market that will add up to increased revenue to the athletes and to the athletics and to the improvement of the global sports marketing. Um, other than that, um, if you have any questions, please let me know. Um, I'm, I'm gonna be more than happy to uh, respond to questions at, at, any, at any time. Thank you so much.